Hi guys, my name is Sven. I make documentaries for a small company in Northern Holland. In early 2019, I was commissioned to make a documentary about the British Department of Work and Pensions. Now, legally speaking, I have to say this footage is not allowed to air in the UK, and I'm kind of throwing my career away by releasing it. Um, but I believe people have a right to see this. So here it goes. Okay, well, Bernard, how long have you worked for the Department for Work and Pensions? Five? Wait, no. Six years now. How has it been that long? What attracts you to do this job? Is it obvious? No, not really. You don't feel any empathy towards your claimants? No, I most certainly do not. So you don't think the government owes the people a basic right to life? If you don't pay the taxes for that, then why do we pay them for? Critics say that the current legislation set forth by DWP is designed not to help people, but extort vulnerable people into work with poverty and starvation. Can you comment on this? Look, if you're not willing to work, then you're not going to eat. You are ignorant. What about socio-economic prejudices that keep low-income families trapped in a cycle of poverty? My name is not Bernard the babysitting Banbury. <laughs> what about empathy? What about the duty of care you should feel as a good person to help people less fortunate than you? What about the willpower? Do you know what I don't understand? It's fair to be frank. It's probably a lot you don't understand. It costs 65 grand to imprison someone. And another 40 grand every year they spend in jail. That works out at about 100 pounds a day. What's your point? Poverty and crime go hand in hand, Bernard. When you don't have money, you steal or sell drugs. And pretty soon you have slums overrun with crime, streets are washed with drugs, and police spends millions tackling a problem which costs 54 pounds a week. Like I said, I don't make the rules. I just enjoy them. You enjoy persecuting people who can't defend themselves. Persecuting people who can't defend themselves is the reason why I get out of bed in the morning. You piece of shit! Don't worry. You got it all on tape. And I'll personally testify in court. I want to punch him in his smug face. Makes you feel any better. He does. It does. Thanks. If you ever need anything, just call me. Thank you. I will. Your soft touch wouldn't last long in this job. You're the worst person I have ever had the misfortune of meeting. That woman was clearly disabled. The all moved. I didn't see it. I stand by my decision. We will see if the public will feel the same way. You think the public give a shit about these animals? They care about themselves and no one else. I stand by my decision, and they will too.